There are several options to managing chronic pain. Acupuncture is one of them that some patients swear by. In tonight's Health Feed, Kellyland Sophie Heineman talks to a local woman about how it's helping her. You've been okay. Uh, you're still having a lot of problems with the neck. Following multiple back surgeries and chronic pain stemming from issues including arthritis and bone spurs, Donna Lindstrom was in need of relief. When acupuncture was suggested, she was skeptical. And it was kind of humorous. I, I never, you know, I just thought it was, a, it couldn't be true that that stuff works, you know. But after receiving the treatment, Lindstrom's skepticism turned into belief. And it was just amazing. It really was. It's just get, given me a, a good life. We want to be at. So much so that Lindstrom has been traveling two hours every week for 13 years to continue receiving acupuncture from Dr. Chang. Acupuncture is uh, placing a fine needles into different areas of the body. And then what I also do is provide electrical pulses, currents to the area. What does it feel like getting the needles put in? Well, you can feel them, but it doesn't hurt at all. Other than some slight bruising or occasional bleeding, Chang says patients won't experience any side effects, but they will experience long-term pain relief. This is a way to, to control their pain without taking medication, and I have found great success. I've been doing uh, acupuncture over 30 years, and uh, so um, I have pretty much the majority of patients do really nicely. With the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services recently finalizing a decision to cover acupuncture for patients with chronic low back pain, Chang is hopeful private insurance companies will follow suit. Costs are very minimal, and so the acupuncture definitely saves lives because now the opioid crisis is everywhere. With Healthbeat, I'm Sophie Heineman.